day, YouTubers. What we got today is a Super Cobra 1KW. I got this in the mail. Um, got to go through it, find out what's going on with it. Um, I've already pretty much figured out what's up with it. Uh, it's a base unit, but uh, somebody stole the power supply out of it. Uh, they sent it to me just to fix the amplifier side. They're going to put the power supply in themselves. Um, but uh, this is what we got. Uh, basically, um, it's a 5 pill. Um, pretty pretty rough shape. Um, looks like somebody might have spilt something in here or something of that nature. Screws are all kind of rusty down there. And then when you cruise through it, you see some of the screws are white. Uh, transformer here is all white. I don't... I don't know what's up with all that. Well, it's just old. Uh, black all in this back corner. Uh, doesn't key up, so can't circuits out of it. We're going to fix that. Now, uh, this tuner was in it originally. It wasn't making no power. So I pulled the tuner. Um, put this tuner in there for now. We're going to hard cap this whole amp. Tuners just aren't uh, or two beans, two cent and and RF applications. They're nice to use on the test bench to tune out, but uh, normally RF takes them out. They're not they're not voltage, high enough voltage usually for these things, but um, this is what we got. Uh, we'll be back in a little while with it uh, cleaned up and in action. We'll see ya. Okay, back to this uh, five pill here, our Cobra, and uh, I'll put a key and circuit in it, that's all it really needed, um, and then I'll put tuner, tuned it out, and now we're going to get busy on cleaning it up, but I wanted to show a video of uh, the output first, as it st stands right now. On the left is power, that's a thousand watt slug we have in there. And then of course on the right is reflect and we have a 5 watt slug there and that's at the radio. A little over, that's right at a 100 watt dead key, somewhere in there. Oh, oh yeah. So that's 300, oh yeah. And almost a watt. Well, half of a watt I should say. That's 5 watt slug, so half of a watt on reflect. So uh, that's what we got with it right now. We're going to make some changes on to see if we can't get some more power out of this and uh, a little bit better reflect. We'll be back with an update. All right, we're back to the uh, Super Cobra 1KW. I guarantee you we're getting a KW out of it now. We made a whole bunch of changes, put a, replaced the relay in it, new relay, uh, rewrapped all the uh, transformers, uh, did a whole bunch of different stuff to it. We got a rocking and rolling now. Same old, same old. Output on the left, reflect on the right. Oh, yeah. Hello, 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 hello. So, as you see, the reflex just barely moving. 5 watt slug still. 1000 watt slug over there. Oh, yeah. Hello, hello. And that's about 460. Uh, average 450. So, uh, not bad. Got the meter working in the face of it, too. It didn't work before. Oh yeah, oh yeah, hello, one, 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 oh yeah, so not bad, this is on um, 15 volts is where we got the supply at, so uh, once this guy builds his uh, transformer setup for it, old Mr. Real Deal is going to build the transformer setup, it's going to have him a nice little box, probably do a good easy 500 bird with one of those floating transformers, so uh, hope y'all enjoyed it. I enjoy putting the videos out. Y'all have a super fine one. I'll stick me in at the no-name MCB shop. And we're gone.